If you have never used the Quick Selection tool, here's a quick demonstration on how it works. We'll pick up the tool itself and at the top you'll see there's Quick Selection or the Magic Wand tool. We want the Quick Selection and you'll see that the brush head can be controlled with the left and right square brackets. The right square bracket will make the brush bigger, the left square bracket will make it smaller. So whatever picture you're working on, make the brush size a suitable size for your picture. And as you see at the moment, inside the circle there is a minus sign. We want that to be plus. So we'll go up here to these three icons here and we'll click on the plus. Come down and just simply click in the yellow part of our address and then come down and you see that it's automatically selected most of its dress. Click up here where it hasn't selected and you'll see here it hasn't selected the top of the dress which we want. So we'll go up to here and pick up the minus brush and we'll come in and we'll just click in and that fills in very nicely into her neckline and the arm which wasn't selected. Come over here and pick up the magnifying glass and make sure that you are in the plus for the magnifying glass and zoom in around her hand and you see here we've selected some of our fingers which we don't really want. So once again pick up the brush and a minus sign and come in and make the brush very much smaller with your left square bracket and we don't want that part and we don't want that part and we don't want that part but what we do want is the yellow between her fingers so we come up and click on the plus make your brush very much smaller and go in and pick up the space between her fingers there and there and just a little bit here double click on this hand which will bring it back to the normal magnification and now hold down your command key on the Mac and the control key on the PC and tap the letter U on your keyboard and the hue and saturation dialog box will appear. And all you have to do here is to drag the hue slider in whichever direction you want, to the left or to the right, and pick a suitable color for her dress, let's say a nice mauvey color. And here you have the advantage that you can saturate it or desaturate it, make it paler or saturate it and make it very much darker. In this method of changing the color of clothing you still retain the underlying definition of the creases and folds. And here we can change the lightness and the darkness. And there we are, you click OK. Put your finger on the command key or the control key and tap the letter D which will deselect and your job is finished. I hope you've enjoyed this short tutorial and I look forward to speaking to you in future tutorials. Thank you.